Well, turning things now to the weather. We know that each home is different and we all want to feel safe and protected, especially when we have severe weather in the spring. Chief Meteorologist Ashley Bercy back here again with yeah. another round of Severe Weather Awareness Week. And now we're talking about manufactured home safety. That's right. Today officially wraps up Severe Weather Awareness Week. I wish we could just wrap up the season, but right. we're just now kickstarting it. And so depending on where you live or when your home was manufactured, uh, your home was created to withstand a certain wind zone. So these zones use wind speed as a determining factor to how strong or secure your home is during a wind event. Now, most of the country is in zone one, which is 70 mile per hour winds. Zone two is 100 mile per hour wind speeds with zone three being the most resistant against severe weather. We found there's actually um, a big difference in the strength of the home between the zone one home and the zone three home. Um, and there is a cost difference, but it's really not huge. So we encourage people that even if you're in um, zone one, most of the country, ask so if you are considering buying a manufactured home, experts suggest that you inquire if your home can get upgraded to a zone three level of material to better keep your family safe and always know where that tornado shelter is in your community.